Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Um, so today we've got a new addition to the shop. It's, um, it's a Harrison M300 lathe. <laughs> I've got to say thanks to Rob over at Extreme Engineer and Extreme Plasma for basically sending me this lathe. It's something I've always needed, something I've always wanted. I haven't got a clue how it works. So what we're going to do today is we're going to have a quick look at the lathe and then we're going to do a repair. There's a few little bits and pieces that are broken on it. One of them is one of the handles on the carriage. Uh, I really need to fix that before I can use it. So let's crack on with it. So this used to be attached to that. And this used to be attached to that. So what we've got to do is break it all down and uh, let's see if we can make a repair. Okay, so what I'm going to do is take this off, um, clean it up, and this has been brazed, so I think I'll just take braze it back onto this. Um, so let's crack on with it, shall we? So we're going to have to clean this up quite a bit. So the first thing I want to do is get this bit of thread out of there. So we're going to build that up, mm, chuck a nut on there, weld it in, and take it out. That should be quite easy.
Okay, so there's a little bit of TIG welding, TIG brazing. Oh, I'm not too keen on that. I'm not sure. Um, I've never actually brazed with a TIG on cast iron before, so I'm not sure whether it's the rods or me, the wrong setup. That's something I'm going to work out. Normally, to be honest, if I was going to do it, I would have used stainless steel wire, filler wire. It just seems to work for me. As always, thanks to my sponsors, Extreme Plasma. Thanks to Artec for supplying the TIG and you guys for coming back and watching. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I enjoyed it, it's something completely new for me. I'm, um, I'm by no means experienced with a lathe, as, this, as it shows. I'm by no means experienced with TIG brazing, as that shows. But anyway, <laughs> catch you on the next one.